In this video I'm going to be giving this Shark Hoover a service. We're going to be looking at all the filters and I'm going to show you the model number before I start. It's NV601UK31. So we're going to start by removing the air filter, so we climb the hoover back. And under here, there's a little tab. That just simply comes out. It actually looks fairly clean. And what I plan to do with that is blow it out with an airline. Then, working up the hoover, you put it back up right you can uh, remove the dust collection bin and then in here just give it a little pull oh dear that's quite messy we have a filter which is very blocked and then not forgetting the inner filter, there's a little tab there to pull it out with. And we're going to give all this a good clean. And I'm going to get a damp cloth to these gaskets on the hoover side and the collection bin. So we're going to open the collection bin up. Quite tricky to do one handed. And we're going to give this gasket a wipe, clean all the excess dust off in the hope that it, it reseals a little better. And remove this filter here, give that a clean. This can actually be separated. I can wash both parts quite safely. Okay, I've just dismantled the air filter and we've washed that out. And then we're going to get a bit of compressed air. You could replace this, but I don't know if you splashed it out with compressed air. Put it in advice to prevent it blowing away. We have quite a selection of the uh, parts to reassemble. Once so you've cleaned them all out in the sink, we'll make a start reassembling them. This one's for the air filter. That's been washed out the innard. filter so we'll refit them in the vacuum cleaner one thing I want to share with you is the dust collection bin clean the gaskets there and also that gasket this mesh filter is not well I didn't find a way of removing it I suspect it's glued in Clean that and this here. So now we'll refit all the filters. First up, put that in. Did a bit of cleaning in there, but I didn't manage to get everything off. And I believe that's the correct way.
and then we can refit the dust collection bin. Moving on to the air filter. There's a little click there. And then we can remove the, the roller by pressing both of these simultaneously. I'm just simply pulling the roller out. So I'm going to get a pair of scissors and remove anything what shouldn't be here. Any stringy things. Quite good how they've got the, the grooves there to get the scissors in. Quite like that feature. We can now refit the roller, keep the pull tab up, and shut that up. And so we now have one fully serviced shark vacuum cleaner. Hopefully, it should improve its suction and do a little bit of a better job. Hoovering around the house, be a little bit more efficient than before. Um, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more repair videos.